We know the Lanham Act is the principal federal law governing trademarks. But can a party assert a false advertising claim against one of its competitors under this act? And if so, must the relevant advertisements literally be false? The 2012 case of Innovation Ventures LLC v. NVE Incorporated examines these questions in the context of one energetic battle. Innovation Ventures sold an energy shot product called 5-Hour Energy. About a year later, NVE, another company in the diet and nutritional products market, came out with its own energy shot called 6-Hour Power. A third company came out with a product called the 6-Hour Energy Shot. Innovation successfully sued the third company for trade dress claims and obtained a preliminary injunction and recall order against it. In response, Innovation decided to issue and distribute its own additional recall notice after the order that read in part, quote, recall of six-hour shot ordered, unquote, and repeatedly referenced that the recall applied to, quote, six-hour, unquote, energy shots rather than naming the third company's recalled product. A couple months later, Innovation sued NVE in district court for trademark infringement and NVE countersued Innovation for false advertising regarding its recall notice. NVE alleged that Innovation's recall notice misled and confused retailers into thinking NVE's product was recalled. The district court found for Innovation on the false advertising claim, and NVE appealed to the Sixth Circuit, contending that the district court shouldn't have excluded NVE's evidence of innumerable retailer calls to establish consumer confusion. 